Welcome to another episode of the King of the Road Show on Fox 4 KBTV. The King of the Road Show is a national award-winning program produced by Southeast Texans for Southeast Texas. King of the Road. Welcome to the King of the Road Show. I'm Jim King. It's hard to believe that this program marks the 290th episode of our award-winning local show. As someone once said, man, how time flies when you're having fun. And we've had loads of thrills since we launched this one-of-a-kind show almost six years ago. We're also looking forward to many more adventures coming up down the road. In the meantime, don't forget to stream the all-new King's Country for the best country music mix anywhere 24-7 at kingscountry.net. You'll never hear any crappy country on King's Country. All of our tunes are handpicked by legendary radio personality and programmer Mickey Ashworth. Stream King's Country at home or work on your PC and on the go with your smartphone plugged into your vehicle's dashboard. Stream the all-new King's Country 24-7 at kingscountry.net, sponsored by the Logon Cafe in Beaumont. Coming up on this milestone 290th episode, we'll look in the rear view at the recent Taste of the Triangle in Beaumont. We'll also wear some bonus concert footage from Wayne Toops and Zyda Cajun at Mardi Gras, Southeast Texas in Port Arthur. We'll be airing Sugarland, Texas native Katie Armiger's latest music video on King's Music Clip of the Week, sponsored by Starvin' Marvin's Bar and Grill in Beaumont. But first, we'll cruise back to remote control hobbies in Beaumont. Ride shotgun with me as we cruise to Parkdale Mall. Extra large and turbocharged. It's the King of the Road Show. Oh, hi. One man has the power to take you behind the scenes. King of the Road. Jim King of the Road. Remote control hobbies right across Mashley Furniture, Parkdale Mall. Always things going on here, especially on the weekend. We're over here talking to uh, Sherry Mitchell, the owner. Just did some uh, remodeling, didn't you, Sherry? We sure did. We ripped out all the old nasty carpet. Spent days and days and hours and hours repainting the floor. Because the gas price is going through the roof, thanks to, I'm not going to mention any names. We're now bringing in racing go-karts, gas-powered scooters, gas-powered skateboards. Can't fire it up because it runs on gasoline, and we don't want to... Uh, get the fire marshal involved but it's it has the same type of concepts and flexibility that the electric skateboard does have and this would be really cool for anybody who's going to Lamar University who needs to get from their dorms to their classrooms yeah, if the gas prices go any higher we'll probably all be riding skateboards and uh, go-karts to work right. I think we've got the gas powered skateboards we've got electric power skateboards we're bringing in 50 size mopeds right now we are sold out the 50 size mopeds are basically, um, you know, top speed on them is 35 miles an hour. Class C license is all you need. Uh, you get about 100 miles to a gallon. So if you're looking for something that's uh, fuel efficient and is going to save you money on not only insurance but gasoline, come and see us and we'll hook you up with the right vehicle. Of course, Remote Control Hobbies also has plenty of RC cars for young people and for adults who are still young at heart. Remote Control Hobbies right across from Ashley Furniture, Parkdale Mall. You need to come in here and see all the new changes they have. You got these uh, slot car racing now that uh, a lot of kids are taking advantage of. They can come in here and uh, rent a few hours on there. Oh, definitely. I mean, they can start off as simple as, you know, $10 can play on our track for, you know, set amount of time. Or they can actually buy their own slot car, pay $5 to play all day long, which is basically babysitting service for mom for $5 for a whole day. I mean, where can you find a babysitter inside Parkdale Mall for $5? Remote Control Hobbies is the right place to find all your remote control toys at discounted prices. They have just about any radio-controlled vehicle on the market in one place. I tried my hand at a remote-controlled helicopter. Dump it up in the air. Get a little bit higher. See, now you ain't got to order up the backwash coming off the ground. There you go. Now use your right hand to go forward. Get a little more throttle, a little more throttle. You're doing good. And then you can also use your right hand to turn it twice. Like this. There you go. There you go forward. 
Let's push up on your right hand. See? It's a beginner style chopper. So always keep your hands, don't ever take your fingers off of the control. Always keep them on your kitchen. So you always hold up on up and go. I figured it was better to quit while I was still ahead before I broke the copter and had to pay for it. Get it out from behind. I knew if you could tear it up, you'd tear it up. Hey, hey, it's still going. <laughs> Lucky for me and you, Remote Control Hobbies now has a real flight learn to fly simulator. You can actually learn to fly before you buy. Every model on here is a real model you can actually buy. You know, we have we have a basic we have a basic real flight, then we have a more advanced real flight, you know. And so a lot of people guys come in, they want to buy the chopper, but then they, they don't want to buy the simulator. But they don't realize this is not a video game. This actually teaches you how to fly everything from jets, helicopters, you know, and this thing behaves exactly like the real chopper, you know. You start to bank them, bring them back, you know. And this, and see, you get them up, like, if, if you fly them this way and stuff, you'll get to the point where you got, you know, like, you can get the sun in your eyes, see that? Just like if you're really flying the real thing. It simulates real flight if you were outside of really flying a model. You can get to point two where you just keep practicing. These helicopters are capable of all kinds of things. If you hit the idle up switch, you know, then you get to the point where you can actually crash them. Then there's a, there's a, there's a mode that'll show like it shows how much damage you've done. Like that, that crash would have been pretty bad so it might pull up, oh you wiped the whole thing out. I want to show you guys some different vehicles that we carry in remote control hobbies. This is an example of a 16th scale slash that we've actually modified here in remote control hobbies. It has a roll cage on it, has dual steering servos, taken the plastic A-arms and took them off and added aluminum. It also has CVDs instead of a plastic drive line, also has a custom painted body. This one is one of the fifth scale vehicles. It has a gasoline powered or a chainsaw motor on it. This vehicle has a upgraded pipe system on it, upgraded motor, runs off a spark plug just like a chainsaw. This one will push out about 10 horsepower, probably going about 45 to 50 miles an hour. Um, also, too, we are doing in-house financing. Bring me the sign, please. This is something that's unheard of when it comes to the hobby industry. Where can you go and get in-house financing on your hobby? Whether it's a boat or a Traxxas T-Max or on a go-kart, come in, fill out the application. We'll get you in-house financing. It's almost as fun as going to Ashley's Furniture and getting uh, financing on a mattress. You get approved for the financing you actually get to take it home and you make your monthly payments. It's new, it's unusual. We've had quite a few people take advantage of this program and they're loving it. Also, I wanna show you guys a new product that's came out by Traxxas, the 16th scale grave digger. It comes in a backpack. It is two wheel drive like the 10th scale grave digger, but it's actually set up where you can do modifications on it and make it into four wheel drive. You have King Crunch? No, but we could probably find a, a, a king hat or something to put okay. it on one of these. No. <laughs> actually, take off your hat, put it on the 16 scale vehicle. I'm sure it would work I was work actually quite well. in King Crunch once. That's why I asked. I tell you what, I really feel like King of the Road now. I could be King of the Road in this thing. King Crunch. Now this rules. I could go down the road crunching vehicles right and left, pummeling people. Hey, Sean, you need to wear a crown like this when you're driving this thing. And you can really be King Crunch. She'll make a deal for you, folks. Remote Control Hobbies, talk to Sherry Mitchell. Chris is here. You can talk to Terry here all the time, right across from Ashley Furniture in Parkdale Mall. Yes, come on and see us. Looking for a new hobby? How fast do you want to go? Come to Remote Control Hobbies at Parkdale Mall. We offer sales, service, parts, supplies, fuel, and repairs. 
register to win a free gift. And while you're here, rent a remote control car and race it around our indoor track. Bring a little excitement to your life. Get a hobby. Remote control hobbies at Parkdale Mall in Beaumont. It's the King of the Road Show. And coming up later, we'll look in the rear view at Fat Tuesday and Taste of the Triangle. With some bonus concert footage from Wayne Toops and Zydy Cajun. But next, we'll air King's Music Clip of the Week, sponsored by Starvin Marvin's Bar and Grill in Beaumont. You're cruising in the King's Caddy. King of the Road.